Welcome back. It is Thursday, the 27th of October. Who are we working with today? It's my cervix design class. What do you guys got to do? We're working on masking out images and opacities. What we're doing is we're going to take different images and we're going to change the opacity, how much of it you see or don't see by a little slider bar. It's over on the far right side of the of your screen there above your images. You can change the opacity or fill of each of those images. And what does this help us do? Well, this helps us line up images so we can stack them a lot easier and work on our masking so we can so we can eliminate sections of our image so we can create a much cleaner design overall now for this one i'm having you guys work on a self portrait design so you're putting in different things about you different different creative aspects that you like to do with yourself again today uh and for this project is how to use the tools that we have in front of us what do we do how do we use them uh and whatnot another thing that i want you guys to focus on also is not just blending but using the magic wand. What is that going to be doing? You're going to be isolating different sections of the image out with this. And what, what the magic wand does, it selects a, a lar the item of an image that you want to keep and it eliminates everything else so that it does all the cutting for you. I do want you guys to use that, but make sure that you have used this after you've done this manually a few times. And why do I want you to do it manually is because you will find an image that you can't use the magic wand uh, auto selection tool on it because it doesn't select the right thing for you. You and you want to find something else in the image so this is where you have to do it manually uh we will i do have a video tutorial on it and i'm pretty sure i've knocked that out for you guys uh check out my video tutorials on my youtube page for photoshop it gives you guys a good clean walkthrough on different tools and different items uh as always if you get a question on this stuff either a ask me or b google it why because google is so good about photoshop there's so much stuff on there <coughs> sorry <coughs> coffee there's so much good stuff on Photoshop on Google. Google it out, read it, research it on your own, figure out how to do these things. I guarantee two, two or three of you will find something new that I don't know how to do. Um, and I and I encourage that. I want my students to be more knowledgeable than me at the end of the day. So keep working on your, on your stuff. If you guys have questions, it's collaboration time. Talk to me. Send me a question if you got questions. Otherwise, I'll see you guys later. Later, guys.